Why am I filming myself right now? Where is my camera guy? Yo, Javi, get up. We got a full day of filming. Javi? I know how to get this motherfucker's attention. Get some of these. Some of this. Some duck cushions. Can't forget the beer salt. Oh yeah, this motherfucker doesn't want to show up to work, but I'm gonna show him. Abracadabra. Hocus pocus. Um, something else and tacos al pastor. Huh, I guess he's really not coming. All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the vlog. We have another episode for you guys today. I missed Monday because of Memorial Day. I was paying my respects, um, but we got two videos for you guys today. Now, I am filming everything by myself because after only three videos on our YouTube channel, we were able to send our camera guy to Mexico. So thank you guys for the continued support. With that being said, we're gonna get into a leg day workout. You already know the vibe, psychotic pre-workout. It is five o'clock. We got the man, the myth, the legend, golden boy over here. He's gonna fucking do some dry scoops. Let's get it. And go get a solid leg day workout in, so. Single moms. Leg day is gonna suck. Fucking done legs in over a week. <coughs> guys leg day was successful we got all kinds of testosterone flowing now really got a nice pump in um i skipped the cinematic sequence this time because it's literally the same exact workout that i had on last video but um we'll try to get something a little more entertaining this afternoon when we come back um plus we got a full day chocked full of activities for you guys today um so i want to jump right into that yeah <sighs> jumped right into that guys we are ready for the day showered brushed groomed let us do some morning journal prompts get some breakfast in us and uh maybe do a little bit of meditation because it's still only 6 20 right now so we have a lot of time um before we need to be productive today um yeah All right, guys, there you have it. As you saw in the last video, again, everything I wrote down came true. Um, that, so I want to kind of, if I can do it a third time, then you guys kind of know that writing shit down has power in it. Um, and it's very evident there. So for the gratitudes of the day, we have uh, the ability to walk. I actually uh, kind of sprained my ankle yesterday while skating, which is another reason I didn't really film anything at the gym today because all my reps look pretty weak. Um, but that's just because my ankle is in pain right now, but it's okay. Um, the power of youth, it literally amazes me how I can operate on such little sleep and then just wake up and get ready to bang out like the day. Um, as many times as I do consistently. Um, and then my drive as well. Um, I'm very grateful for I don't know why. It's just uh, I feel driven rather than motivated. It's just like, you know, if I'm not motivated, it doesn't matter. I'll, uh, I'll tell myself like, okay, this isn't a discussion. We're doing this. Let's go. Let's execute. Um, <clears throat> my goals for the day, upload two videos by tonight. So vlog and then the secret video that we got coming up. 
um, get one new deal and then read 50 pages of my book. Now, 50 pages is a stretch. I've never actually read 50 pages consecutively at once. So I really wanted to challenge myself today and see if I can uh, get it done. And uh, of course, that's one of my goals. If I can get it done, then I'm going to do a little celebration tonight. So there you have it, folks. Let's get into some breakfast. There we are, guys. Here is the Hard Gainer Special. Peanut butter, banana, oats. Let's do it. And there we go. You know, Hard Gainer Special, guys. Nothing, nothing crazy. Let's get this down. Guys, you gotta check out this view. It is just, you can hear the water in the background. Just a nice little, you know, day to get your day rolling. All right, that wraps up the morning routine. We are now headed to the office to get some contracting work done, as well as film my bonus video for the day. We're actually gonna knock that out probably first thing um, in the morning, and uh, it's, 6.50 right now, so we have plenty of time before anybody shows up. Um, so in this next hour, I'm probably... Actually, I just remembered I need something to film that video. Okay, we got what we needed. So now, for real this time, we are headed to the office. And we're actually going to the new office. It is set up and ready. We officially started operating out of it yesterday. Um, so we are going to give you guys a nice little tour because the place is sick. So... So now that it's just me and you in the car and we can get intimate again. My biggest question for you guys is what, and by you guys, I mean literally like my friends that I send these videos to um, because I haven't popped off yet. So literally, if you're watching this now, you know me personally and I probably sent this to you. So this is literally a direct question and you can comment down below or you can text me or whatever. And um, so my biggest question to you guys is what do you do to avoid burnout? So this weekend, I took a little self-care um, time basically to reset my mind and kind of reevaluate my uh, my goals and just realign my vision. And I find doing a dopamine detox, as I like to call it, um, where you just go the full day without any stimulation. Um, so typically a fast is what you do. Obviously, um, I'm on a caloric surplus right now, so I didn't really fast on Sunday. However, I did eat very low stimulating foods, uh, such as turkey, rice, mashed potatoes, just, just really bland stuff. Um, just super easy to digest. And uh, but, but basically, phone was off, TV was off. Um, literally, all that you're allowed to do is sit in your room and go for a walk like that's it you can't even read or journal or anything because that's all dopamine forms of stimulation and the whole point is to completely reset your dopamine receptors and so i find doing that is like a great way to reset my brain and just kind of realign my vision and uh i find it helps with burnout because there are some days where literally i'm just like i don't want to do this shit anymore fuck this <laughs> but i i keep going you know like i i get after it anyway um you know life has its ups and downs but uh you just got to keep showing up you know um so i just want to know what you guys do to avoid a burnout like what's your what's your routine do you like to go out and party do you you know like what do you do like what when life is just a lot what helps you ground yourself and get ready for another marathon basically um so yeah let me know i would love to hear your guys input on that and uh, I don't know, I kind of want to feature you guys in these videos a little bit more. Um, I'll think of something to throw throw the best answers in at some point. Maybe we'll do like a, like an on the phone interview or not interview, but like just like, I don't know, something. We'll, we'll figure it out later. But anyway, time to get to the new office. It's kind of a drive. So let's uh, do a quick transition. And just like that, we are here, guys. Gosh, I love cinematic sequences. You can literally just teleport. It's awesome. We are first ones here. Feels good. Always be first one in, last one out if you want results others don't have. All right, so we're just going to post up here. And let's uh, cue the cinematic sequence for... Uh, the new office, but hold up first. I actually want to get a super sick transition. We're gonna do something like this and There 
you have it guys that was the office tour looks amazing always fun to be a part of something bigger than yourself something always growing a community of people that are just out there doing stuff it's awesome it's awesome to be a part of this um you know let's uh let's show you guys a little bit of what we got going on in our desk um a little desk tour action and then we're gonna set up for this bonus video that i'm uploading today all right walking in we got the man the myth the legend hard at work getting the paperwork done right here we got the desk the setup you already know i got my light shout out to the office ladies for getting me that light it's freaking awesome got some computer stuff over there business cards all kinds of uh you know presentation stuff you know the goodies there the laptop alienware all day and you know i got my ipad portfolio all that stuff there too so um without further ado let us set up for this video all right guys video is done we are now in the office it is full blown we got the whole gang here we're all doing busy work i am going to run to a repair with mr smart over here we have to fix some people's mistakes but it's okay because that's what we're here for and uh we're happy to do so um afterwards we're gonna write some estimates make a couple phone calls and then uh head off to our appointments for the afternoon probably grab some lunch along the way somewhere there so stay tuned for that ride all right guys we are running to that repair got the gang hey guys change of plans we pulled up to the job and what happened Fucking. Joe Davis. The materials weren't there. So we are back in the office and we have our handy dandy notepad. Lifesaver. If you guys don't have a notepad, get one because I would not know what to do with myself if I didn't have a to-do list every single day. So we're going to write the estimate. Uh, I got to touch base with this client. We need to get a quote, um, more updated numbers, <sighs> make some marketing stuff, um, and prepare orientation for some of our laborers so we have a couple things to take care of and we have about an hour two hours to do it and yeah that's a lot of stuff to take care of in that time so we're going to try our best um but it's okay we're going to hammer through as much of this as possible um and then we have a team meeting at downtown today we're going to go there um, but it's just reprioritizing right now and yeah, so let's do it. Say hi to the vlog. I like when you did Cassandra. Yep, Cassandra and Kaylin cams. Same on each side and you guys know what. Heck yeah, I am. This light's sick. Are we going right now? Yeah. Alright, guys. Alright, all right, guys. We are going right now. I got all of 5% of my work done. Let's go. Say that, say that one more time for the vlog. This job's about to be at 30 grand. Oh, just for a roof and oh, gutters. God, it's a it's a beautiful thing what we do here uh, at Soderberg. All right, guys. Well, I got a lot less done than I thought I was going to get done. Um, but it's okay. We are keeping the day rolling, rolling with the punches. I think I got a little time right before, right after this to finish up what I was doing, and uh, yeah. So we are going downtown now. Get some grub. It is lunchtime. You know what that means? Top button down for the single moms. Yep. Oh, snap. Uh, that, was, that was appropriate. It's appropriate. We're still semi-casual with the bottom button, but the top button is gone now that it is lunch. So let's go get some lunch. Eh? Ladies and gentlemen, we have pulled up to the joint. You already know the vibes. Let's get some. Well, I was actually going to hope that we can both go and, you know, you get POV of both people in the same situation. You know, you ever see those vlogs where you got two vloggers in the same room and it's like you go watch his video and then you go watch the other video to see like the different perspectives. But anyway, we're here. We got the whole gang here. 
chilling. Um, getting some lunch. We ordered chicken parm. We're gonna get the carb loads for the afternoon because it's going to be a long one. Um, Jared Camp. <laughs> That's great. Jared, just take a big rip out of that real quick. For the vlog, take a big rip out of your drink. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Rip it. Perfect. Guys, we got the filth out appetizer. We are getting it rolling. Ladies and gentlemen, you know what time it is. Kaylin and Cassandra time. <laughs> Kaylin and Cassandra cam. Coming in. Do shots. Drink all that ranch at once. <laughs> All right, guys, me and Joe have snuck, around, snuck out to this back room, and I got fun games here. He's about to punch the punching machine. He's gonna get a crazy high score. I'm gonna get sub 300. All day. Nice. Oh, wow. What the fuck? We're gonna just have to fucking share the video. On the line. This is a crazy walk a doodle spin shot. And this is for any. Boom. Ladies and gentlemen, it does not look good right now. We're going to try to get this dunk for the single moms, but no promises. I got lucky as fuck. Oh, and he scratched it. He scratched it. I'm the fucking winner, boys. The winner, he scratched it right at the end, but it's okay because we're going to go enjoy some food now. I'm new. The filth has arrived, ladies and gentlemen. All righty, guys, that wraps up lunch. Um, we are now headed off to the repair because the materials are now there. We're gonna meet Carson there and get the crew rolling. All right, guys, we just did the repair. Um, little on-site training, it was awesome. We got Joe. And he all righty we have pulled up right in time kind of for the appointment block let's finish up what we did earlier oh fucking great and we will see you guys there So we have wrapped up everything, uh, well mostly everything. We got that done just now. The estimate is written. We touched base with the church and got the spray foam coat on the way to the repair. So that is taken care of. Now we need to do marketing uh, stuff, get one deal and prepare for the roofer orientation going on tomorrow. But luckily, all I gotta do is focus on getting a deal right now and the rest have minimal consequences and I can take care of that in the morning. So. Now let's run to do some appointments and get the bag secured. Guys, we are live on scene here. Got the Soderberg crew pulled the F up. Mr. Caleb over there running the inspection. 
Joe about the man to drone. We got the whole squad here. We are meeting people, neighborhoods, knocking freaking doors. This is great. This is. Sheesh, look at those pings. Look at those pings. New siding. Sheesh. Boral steel too. He wants everything. Oh my gosh. Windows. Oh yeah, there was a kilo over there. Guys, you will never believe this story. Let me just show you the inspection I just got right now. All right, preface to that. All right guys, so this is a legendary story. Um, preface to everything, um, check out this picture. So basically, the mat says, don't solicit, don't knock this, I don't want whatever you're selling, right? And so I go ahead and being the audacious person I am, pull out my sticky note and I write free beer included with a free inspection. And so I put it on the door hanger, leave it there, whatever. Um, me and Caleb are driving by <laughs> a little bit later and we see the dude pulling up. I was like, bro, should I offer him a beer? And like, we pull up and I'm just like this, just like super really like, hey, want a beer? Just like super sketchy, you know what I mean? Anyway, he's like, what? I was like, you see the note? And he was like, he looked at it. He's like, he starts laughing. So he starts shooting the shit. And then uh, he's like, oh yeah, need, need a bunch of stuff done. And uh, here's a little bit of our conversation. We've made a claim with our home warranty company. They're like, yeah, we can't do nothing with that and this. And yeah. I'm like, what? We just bought the house. Like that was damaged before we even bought the house. So, oh, that's crazy. Run, yeah. Well, cool, man. Hey, we're going to be in the community. We're helping some of your neighbors. If you ever see us around, come say hi. Okay. Uh, hit the shit, you know, if we got a beer, we'll always crack one too. You know what I mean? Did you give them a card or anything? Yeah, yeah. Okay. We got, yeah. yeah, you can give them that brochure too. too. I was going to yeah. say, yeah, check, just check that out. On, on the, the door hanger, on my card on the back of it, there's a QR code. You can go ahead and scan that. Check out our Facebook page, YouTube page, kind of see who you're working with uh, okay. in the future. And yeah, man. Okay. I appreciate it. Yeah, cool. Well, that's all I got for you. Have a wonderful Thank rest you. of your day and we'll see you around. Thank you. But yeah, I thought that was so cool. It's literally always knock it. That's all I have to say. Always like opportunity is not going to come to you if you don't look for it, if you don't search for it. And now I got a new client. He's a super cool guy. Pulling deep. Field cam. What do you guys think? Hi, baby. How's your day going? Uh, man, it's kind of slow. We're gonna yeah. pick it up a little bit, go find some hail, and uh, knock these motherfuckers in the head. Yeah, I've only been on one roof to be honest with you guys. I got three got back three? to back to back. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've been on one. Yeah, we've been at it for like an hour now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yep. Gotta keep going though. Oh, We're yeah. headed to the next stop. All right, guys, that wraps up our knocking session. We are officially done soliciting. So we are headed for now. For now. For, for now. now. You guys are safe for now, but I will knock on your door one day. Um, so now we are heading to a networking event that we have here in Sedalia with the chamber. Um, we're gonna go shake some realtors' hands, see if we can't form any new business relationships in the community and kind of establish ourselves a little bit more. If I can get any footage there, I will, but it's more of a formal thing. So I don't really know how they're gonna feel about some like kid coming in like, I vlog, you know, type of thing. So we'll, we'll see what happens. Networking thing was a bust, but we got on top of another roof. So let's do a quick inspection real quick. Caleb, okay, what are your comments on this? Oh, no problem being bought. Plenty of hits on this side. I'm not sure about this side. Both of our soft metals are dinning. No ventilation? Yeah, no ventilation. Um, I don't know about the gutters yet. Um, but I don't think we'd have any problem in this box. Yep. Soft metals. And this is what we're looking for right there. Hail damage. Pretty solid day if you guys ask me. Um, now we're just kind of waiting for Chris to pull up. This man pulls up in style. Hold up, let me get in this lighting room. This lighting's awesome. Dude, heck yeah. That was awesome lighting. Or, I mean, that was an awesome entrance. Whoop. Both the lighting too. Yeah, the lighting too. I'm just, you know, I'm just enjoying this lighting. You know. What are you about to do, Chris? I know it's it's motherfucker in the arm, tag his ass. Wait, wait, you're gonna do what? I'm fucking tag his ass. Oh my gosh. Office. 
Yeah, this is why you don't leave uh, the boys in the office after down. hours. That's like the easiest spot to get tagged. All right, go. Yeah, for nothing. Seriously. All right, gotta stick it on me and hold it for a second. All right, that's it. Here. Oh! Yep, it sure helps. <laughs> 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 Oh god, bro. Hell yeah. Alright guys, our day of deal hunting and ring appointments went great. Um, To-do list, we hammered through it. We do have marketing stuff. And the presentation to prepare for the roofers tomorrow. But we will take care of that tomorrow. Luckily, there are minimum consequences if we do it today. And you know, if you know me, you know I love minimum consequences. I'm beat, so I'm going to go home. It's 7.30 right now. I'm actually turning off all this stuff. Let's see, someone. Um, I'm turning, um, I'm going to go get the calorie count in and read the 50 pages uh, that I still need to read. And we'll be golden from there. Uh, editing this vlog, I've realized that I have ran so far ahead of schedule so whatever i will work on it and getting the video shorter got our meal we're going to finish editing this video and upload it and read some book and get to bed because it's almost eight o'clock been running since 4 30 slept at like 11 uh the other night or last night and yeah, it's been a it's been a long day. So, thank you guys for tuning on in. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, tell your friends about my videos if um, you enjoyed them. If you watch this far, comment um, spaghetti sauce, and I will like I don't know something special will happen. I just haven't decided yet. But anyway, it's been real. It's been fun, but it hasn't been real fun. Take it easy, guys.